Konnichiwa, this is the Shogunstein. There's Mushu. And this is Talon Strikes Studios, which is a local game company here in the West Valley of the Phoenix area, here in Phoenix, Arizona. It's about 110 degrees today, but I got a lot cooler today because look what showed up in the mail. My Kickstarter edition of Vinyl, a game by Eric Alvarado from Talon Strikes. Again, a great local company here in the uh, Phoenix area. They do a lot supporting uh, local gaming here in uh, the West Valley. They've made some other good games. If you like the, the Liar's Dice, and a variation of that is the House of Borgia, named after the uh, famous uh, patrons and uh, Pope family in Renaissance era Italy. This is a game made by Scott Alms, um, who is very famous for a lot of the tiny epic games from Gamelin, another local company here in the Phoenix area. That's from Talon Strikes. And then uh, the game by the uh, the head of Talon Strikes, Jason Washburn, King's Champion, which is a, uh, the box is small, but man, there is a lot of game in King's Champion. You would never know by the size of this box how deep, probably one of the deepest two-player small box games you're ever going to play. King's Champion, which, uh, as you can tell from the cover, deals with jousting. So, Talon Strike Studios has made some smaller games, some great games. Again, King's Champion, House of Borgia, but their uh, flagship game just came out, and that's going to be Vinyl. This is a game I'm very excited about because it combines two of my favorite things in the world. Music, records. Yes, the Shogunstein uh, is old enough to remember vinyl before uh, CDs and before cassette tapes. I still remember buying vinyl records. I believe the store is called Super Stuff on Hempstead Turnpike in uh, Levittown. And then also... Uh, Record World at TSS Times Square store, also in Hempstead Turnpike in Levittown. And then uh, my old man had a tremendous record collection uh, as well. I remember growing up as a kid, he just had thousands of uh, records that he unfortunately sold at a garage sale. Guy took a look at his collection and gave him a couple grand right on the spot. So who knows how much that stuff was really worth. But vinyl, very excited, Talent Strike Studio. We got the Kickstarter edition, which came with a couple of expansions. The Masters of Metal expansion, which requires the, the base game. And then we also got the Kickstarter exclusive Top Shelf, which also requires the base game. There is also another expansion called British Invasion, which I will be uh, getting shortly. Can't wait to pick that up. But uh, the, the pledge level that I did on Kickstarter came with these again, the uh, Top Shelf and the uh, Masters of Metal. And I will be picking up the British Invasion as soon as I can. So let's take a look at what's in this awesome box here for vinyl. Again, this game is going to be huge Talent Strikes. This is going to be a studio to watch Talent Strike Studio. So vinyl, let's take a look what we got inside the box. And oh, speaking of Talent Strike Studios, this is, was their latest Kickstarter, Winterborn, a game that I got to help play test and uh, play in uh, a couple of different forms. It's a Viking themed game that uh, was funded uh, a few months back and is coming in 2019. So if you want a really deep Viking themed game, that's next from Talon Strikes Studio. It's a great game. Uh, I can't wait for my Kickstarter to come in, but again, I've played it when it was a prototype and I played uh, uh, the production copy. And in fact, you can go to uh, the website and then there is a live uh, playthrough, and I'm one of the, the players. I believe I'm the player that came in last. So we have our instruction book. So let's take a look here. And again, game designer Eric Alvarado, Jason Washburn, who is the, the head of Talent Strikes, and uh, the play group here. There's my friend uh, Nathan. All right, so let's take a look what we got here. We have... Our instructions, pretty comprehensive instruction book here. 
showing us how to play with lots of illustrations. There we go. Explaining the different cards. And then the top shelf expansion directions. Uh, some of the other. Uh, the British Invasion expansion explained. And then the one that I have here, Masters of Metal. This instruction book is not just for the base game, but also covers the expansions. And then, uh, oh, I guess this is the two or three player game only, non-playable customers. Okay, interesting. So we have a two or three. That would be what the Shogunstein usually plays at, that uh, two uh, usually it's me and Little Shogunstein, but uh, we'll get this definitely to game night and get some of the bigger games, so uh, nice little variant here for a small player count. Let's see what else is in the box here. We have our, uh, looks like our player mats. All right. And then it looks like we got plenty of stuff to, to punch out. Look at that little, little discs. Little 45s and LPs. One of the jobs I had in high school was actually to sort 45s to go to record stores. Again, back when they had uh, record stores. All right. Cool. Not exactly sure what these do yet. I don't know. Reminds me of the Punisher, but obviously this has nothing to do with the Punisher. Very cool. Player board right here. The magazine rack. Very cool. So it looks like a nice size board. And then we have some player cards. More players. Some men are born to raise the flag. Ooh, the red, white, and blue. CCR. Some loyalty cards. We got our meeples. Check out these little minifigs. Instruments. Look at these. That is really cool. That is a very unique... Uh, player tokens here, the shapes of the instruments. You don't see that in games every day. And it looks like we just got some extra bags. Nice little insert here that uh, hopefully will also fit the expansions. And again, the box is showing us uh, some of the other games coming out. Winterborn, the Borgia, which I showed you, is already out. You can pick that up. King's Champion, you definitely want to pick that up. And another upcoming game, Kingpins, a uh, clever little card game from from Talon Strikes. So there's a lot of big game companies out there. Nothing against big game companies. They produce a lot of very good games. They have huge Kickstarters that, you know, get millions of, of dollars. Talon Strikes is a small local studio here. It's a studio that does very good work and is an organization that we definitely want to support. And we want to encourage not just the, the big game companies, because they certainly do make very good games, very high quality games, but we also need to remember the, the little publishers out there uh, putting out some very unique content. So vinyl, very unique theme, records, music, again, combines the Shogunstein's two favorite things, music and uh, board games. I wonder if there's any kind of Delamitri or Lord Euron uh, music cards on here. So vinyl, Eric Alvarado game. Just got my copy in the mail today. This was everything in, in the box. And as we get to, to play it some, some more, uh, we'll give you our final thoughts on it. But just very excited to get the, the box and very excited for Talent Strike Studio uh, doing great things here in the, the West Valley of uh, Phoenix. This has been an unboxing of vinyl. Shogunstein out.